<laughs> hey everybody, uh, we're at Summer Games Done Quick because Sarah, people don't know it, this whole thing happens in freaking Minneapolis. I know, it's the one thing we have. So we're gonna go explore and give you a behind the scenes tour of what it's like at Summer Games Done Quick. Here we go. It's, like it's got 50,000 viewers on Twitch, and I'm like, people are attending, right? Like, people actually go to this? Yeah, I think, like, they save it for, like, you know, if there are big moments, big games, mm -hmm. like, then it will really fill up. What is it? It's the room. Oh, there he is. Hey, it's Jeff Gore! <laughs> you guys can, can fight over there. Oh, oh, it's got a chair on it. I want to be number two. On. Hey, you want to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Test Runner. I'm the head of tech at Games Done Quick. Sweet. Can you show us behind the scenes? Sure, yeah. Let's go over there. We'll enter from the salon, whatever number that is. Okay. You got it. All right, see you around, Cork. There is broadcast going on, so we're trying to not be too loud in there. Right now, we're actually on an online segment, so some of the runs are online. So when there's an on-site run, we have to be very careful not to distract on the, the talent on stage, but since this segment's actually online, uh, it means that we just don't want to distract the production staff. So this is the main broadcast room. Um, this is like a green room area, just for the on-deck runners to kind of just chill and wait for the next, the next run. Um, and this is, you have donations over here. They do all the, the tech, all the processing, the donations that come in. Normally, we have to be able to have setups up to four players at a time. So each of these tables is one player. Uh, we also have two PCs. All the stage goes through these two racks. Um, the rack has, we have, these upper ones are the video matrices, which lets us basically send any video to any of the monitors or any of the the capture cards and such. The, all the SD video, um, so composite, components, uh, SCART, so on and so forth, they get routed to something called a RetroTink 5X. The RetroTink 5X is a upscaler, so it can go from the SD low quality video to HDMI high definition. Um, and then that way we can capture everything with HDMI, which simplifies all our tech, uh, and it makes everything look nicer. Is it weird that you're on stage and no one's looking at yeah. you? Yeah, well, and I'm like not really playing a game. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend that's for me. <laughs> yeah, and there's probably like, like at least 10 or so computers back here just all right here. Thank you, everybody. As for other stuff, um, consoles, uh, we basically have to have like every kind of like retro console around, like NES, SNES, N64, PlayStation, you know, Xbox, so on and so forth. All the modern stuff, people usually have their games digitally, so we can't really provide that, so people just bring their own stuff. But, uh, and all our consoles are based, are generally have some sort of RGB mod, makes them the higher quality. <laughs> oh, here are all the consoles. Oh my God. Um, this is just our supply. So one of our partners, World Nine, who's downstairs, uh, they have an absolute truckload of of consoles. So you said backups, fun backups, fun backups. Yeah, most of it isn't RGB modded, but if we need to, they have a lot of stuff. Generally, we don't really need to take their stuff, but most of the stuff is more for the runners uh, to practice on. So mm -hmm. they can go to the practice room. They can like borrow a console and practice on. Uh, but if something here fails, like all of the GameCubes break, for instance, which doesn't happen, then we can run downstairs and get the spare. Mm -hmm. right yeah, so this is interview setup. Um, again, so the main technologies here are going to be they have the X32 for audio, and they use the ATEM Constellation 1ME is for video. Um, and they have you know, producer, camera ops, audio technicians. Um, interview producers, the interviewer themselves, you know, they have a whole entire separate crew. And because we have separate crews, it means that we can work independently and then the head producer can kind of switch between the different sets as we need to. Sweet. Right, awesome. Cool. Thank you so much. Yeah. Right, let's uh, go out this way. Sure. So, How long have you been running a GDQ? I started as staff 2014, and so I've been I've been head of tech since then. Wow. How wow. big is the overall uh, GDQ crew? I think the whole company is like 
40-ish people. Oh, wow. Well, cool. Yeah, Thanks wow. so much. Appreciate it. Yeah, well, good luck with the rest of the show. Oh, thank you. Sarah, we chose a huge online block. Uh, it seems like the worst time to know. come here. I also didn't know. I think we just saw Sonic on the schedule. It's like, oh, this I seems like. I thought Sonic like... was at two. This room is so big. Like, I know. Let's go see it. Let's go see let's it. Let's go stand in the very back of it. That sounds good. You go in the very front, and I'll stand in the back. Okay, that sounds great. We can test out the mics. Yeah. The can you hear me from here? Uh, you can still hear me. There she goes. Goodbye forever. I'm leaving. I quit. I'll be here until 7 p.m. when I can watch Sonic. No, someone's actually sitting there. All these seats taken. Am I on camera? I mean, not the important camera, Ben. Where do you think Jeff Cork would be? I don't know. This feels about right. Check in ish. <gasps> oh my god, you were right. It was exactly. like I spy. Oh. Ah! <laughs> what happened? Oh, there's just a metal <laughs> ridge. What you got there? I have a dorky question. Yeah. So, thanks to Seth from Pretty Good Printing, plug, plug, uh, we have a bunch of MinMax stickers. Mm -hmm. Is there like a table that's... Are you that's... literally trying to self-promote yeah. at SGDQ? Yeah, I think it's that smart. That sounds illegal. Is there some cool place I can put these that wouldn't be obnoxious, but it'd be like, hey, if somebody wants to pick them up... Yeah, what you're going to do is you're going to peel the backing off of all of them. <laughs> right. One on every step of the escalator. Uh-huh. <laughs> okay. And people will be like, what is it. this inconvenience on my shoe? What are these? Are these important? But, these see, this seems like great... trash, too. You like them? Oh, yeah, yeah. They're not a mattress? We could put our stuff within... The American Gladiators. That sounds good, but we want to separate ourselves from the Eliminator. Like, it, we can't. It looks like someone else had the same idea as you. Mm -hmm. yeah, they're promoting the 1980s. Um, so this is good. We can like lure people in with candy and then put up the next stickers. Yeah, let's maybe not use that language. Oh, okay. It's just so embarrassing. Sarah. Yeah. You can't just leave them wrapped like that because that's well, just I'm like. Gonna, he made us a sign. I've been handing them out to game stores. Have you really? Mm-hmm. I think I'm an accessory to a crime. I'm not a part of this. Last year, or when I was here last time, they had like arcades set up and stuff. You That's know? on the second floor. Should we go see it? Let's go see it. So a lot of these like rooms are where people are like, prepping or practicing and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because this, they're not doing it for the first time. These guys have been practicing. <laughs> it's you think true. anybody's winged it up on that stage ever? Oh god, that would be such a disaster. <laughs> That'd be kind of fun to watch, though. Well, we're oh, here. We're here. Yep. Okay, we've played enough games. We can figure this out. Yeah, this exactly. is doable. Sarah, we need your brain. Do you want to put MinMax's YouTube channel up on one of these? <laughs> we're at it. Poker tournament? I love that. Are you into it? Poker speed running? I think this is the board game room. You only got a switch in here. Pretty cool Smash tournament you set up here, Sarah. Thank you. I invited all my friends. <laughs> <laughs> Who do you like, Sarah? Who's the best speedrunner? I like Sarah, all of them. Sarah speaking to her fans. Thank you. They've gathered Thank here people. today to ignore her. <laughs> Throw that brick of stickers at them. <laughs> <laughs> Please. Oh my god, Sarah. What? Do you uh, see what they have here? No. Yes, we see it. Goddamn Sunset Riders. Oh! No, trust me, sir. This is a really good game, actually. You can shoot the barrels, those will fall down. It's pretty much all you want from gaming. This is like having a guy tell you why Steely Dan is cool, actually. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll get you through this. this so I know all the tricks. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Eater rhythm? Oh, wow. Hey, you love this game. I do. I will play a weirdo version of that. And then everyone's favorite, pop in music. <laughs> Jesus Christ, why is it so loud? <laughs> Can you translate everything you see, please? Character selection screen. Ah, oh, got it, got it, got it, got it. You might not notice it, but. <laughs> do you really know this song? Very impressive. I'm an OG. They want her to be on stage for this. <laughs> the word bad in Japanese, it means something completely different. Absolutely. You wouldn't understand. It said success. Yeah. He did it. <laughs>
What is this the actual interface for this? This Got is way it. easier than mine was. Yeah, this is the this fix is of it. Like so, it's outrageous. I'm sorry, expert, you're saying this is actually harder than the game that Sarah played? <laughs> we will never be that cool in a million years. What? Right? I had no idea this it. existed. The washing machine's open. All right. Here we go. May the best gamer win. It says I'm perfect. Mm-hmm. That's weird because it says that I'm in first. What does the star mean? <laughs> Did you understand that? Yeah, but I missed it. Is it a touch screen? Full combo! Full combo! Full combo! Full combo! Full combo! God damn, Sarah! <laughs> it's not important. It's not, we had fun. We had fun. Although, hang on, this looks pretty good too. Let's play this. Do we have to actually stand on it? Yeah, and you gotta like put your thing on the kick pedal. Oh my god. Is this right? Oh my god. What does it say on the screen, Sarah? What does it, it say on the screen? You're in second. Okay, cool. <laughs> there will be no rematch. There will be no rematch. Ridiculous. My thigh hurts. I know, that was a workout. That felt weird. All right, it looked cool. It, you promised us it looked really cool? It looked very cool. And we looked really cool because we were going really fast. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of people walked by and were like, Thanks for joining us, Cork. Bye. Applause for that. He, he absolutely crushed that. Wow. All right. Sarah, what's happening? Ben, people are looking at our stickers. They're looking at the stickers. Look at, stickers. You said it was stupid. You said it never worked. These people are I did. I did in. say it was stupid. They're subscribing to the podcast probably right now. <laughs> Mission accomplished. I can't, I can't believe They're putting it. them in their pockets. They're putting them in their pockets. <laughs> we did it. All right, everybody. Hope you enjoyed this uh, confusing behind the scenes look at uh, Summer Games. <laughs> is this comfortable? Why is it turning? I don't know. Uh, sorry there wasn't a big in person run while we were here. Uh, we really blew it on that schedule. <laughs> I mean, nobody told us. Yeah, we thought there were a lot of folks in the crowd, but hey, we'll probably come back at some point. But if you're in Minnesota, you gotta be here. Mm -hmm. All right, thanks for watching, everybody. Bye bye. If you thought, hey, this video wasn't bad, well, there's a whole lot more like it on MinMax's YouTube channel. Please help us out by subscribing to our channel and checking out the MinMax Show podcast, also available on your favorite podcast app, the best, most thorough discussion about games on the internet with the deepest dive, our monthly community trivia show with prizes called Trivia Tower, and a whole lot more. Thanks so much for your support, everybody. All you gotta do is click that subscribe button. We'd really appreciate it.